Hello everyone, thank you for watching. Uh, this is a, a craft I realized I've never previously posted. It's one that uh, my kiddos and I did years ago. Um, it's really fun, really easy. Uh, we were finding all of the parts at a local thrift store. Uh, you can find shoulder pads in any old shirt that you were going to probably throw away anyways, or like in our case they were 15 cents a pair at the thrift store. <laughs> find all different kinds of fun patterns, sizes, shapes. And then uh, find embroidery hoops, and you may have plenty of these hanging around the house as well. Uh, you can use the exterior or interior part of the hoop, whichever one fits around your child's head the best. Uh, if it doesn't quite fit, you can also put padding on the inside. Uh, but we've just made crayons out of um, shoulder pads, and so they're nice and soft. <laughs> and uh, just let your kiddos decorate them however they'd like with old buttons. Uh, we have all kinds of fun frills that you can find at your local thrift store or art supply store. My daughter has one uh, with flowers and birds all over it. It's uh, Right now it's in her room somewhere probably sitting on top of a dragon's head. But uh, this is my son's and uh, we just used hot glue to glue all of this together. And I actually, there was a ribbon here uh, that came off. I was going to just re-glue that. I thought I would uh, show you the, the craft. Um, these have definitely stood the test of time and uh, it's really fun for the kids to design and pick out their own. Um, and then they still pull these out for Silly Hat Day at school or for theater camp. Uh, you can make any kind of theme that you'd like. And it was one of our favorite projects when we did it. And uh, hopefully you enjoy the idea and uh, make one of your own. You might have to make one for yourself while you're at it. So thanks so much for watching. Have a beautiful day.